Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Elm Creek here in my alternative Let's Play series here in Farming Simulator 22. I have finished the soybean harvest and I can safely say nobody, nobody watched all the way to the end of the last video. And I can say that for definite because nobody left any comments on the last video estimating or predicting how many soybeans I was going to be able to get off of this field. So, you all failed. You all failed to tell me. <laughs> you all failed to tell me how many soybeans we got. Nobody even made a guess. So I'm guessing nobody watches to the end of the videos. So you're all in trouble with me now. You're all in my bad books. <laughs> so let's have a look. How many soybeans did we get? Well, we got 88,849. 88,849. That's going to be worth a bit of money. Uh, when we come to sell them in a in a little bit so i guess what you're wondering is what are we going to be doing today well as promised i'm going to probably split this field up divide it up i think so we're going to probably end up doing a bit of landscaping today now i didn't know whether to leave the mulching and stuff till after I finish landscaping. Possibly. I've got one million quid in the bank, so landscaping's not going to cost me too much money. Right, here's what we want first of all. We want. We're going to want grass. We're going to be putting a road in. I'm not terribly bothered about the edges of the fields being um, being straight. I think it'd probably be more natural if they weren't straight. So we've got that bit. Okay. I think I need to do as well. I think I need to do a little bit more up this edge of the field. You know what? I'm going to do it with the round pool. Although I probably should have done it. Isn't going as I I I'd hoped. There we go. Making a bit of a mess of this. I I know. Um. All right, we're gonna want gravel now. Sort of down here. Uh, no, that's not going to work, is it? Oh. Uh, 
we need to put the meadow bit in. This is the bit. This is where it all gets a bit chaotic. I'm just slapping down grass willy nilly. <laughs> All this will get probably mulched anyway, I can imagine. Cultivated and smoothed and removed. So we just plant the meadow. Grass where we need it. Right, then we go back to planet painting. We'll pick the gravel again. And like I say, we're going to have a an area where um, basically our, our tractors can drive. So that can go down to there, we'll, we'll open that up a bit. Plenty good that. Right. Now we want to split this field up now. Do I want to split it up? Just gonna divide it up like that. Although probably should make a bit more of an effort to smooth that out. And if worst comes to worst, I just uh, get the plow out and do a nice straight line on it again. Right, so now we want plants. Gonna want. I was thinking about just leaving the field, you know, um, as a big, massive, uber awesome field and not doing all of this. bit of paint in there maybe a bigger gravel road going up here across the top go that'll do for me I think I'll get rid of that bit
have to do that with the um, round brush, I think. There we go. So I've got three fields. Yeah. Like I say, probably do want to come round with the plough and just tidy the edges up a little bit on some of them. Uh, which we can do. We'll use the little six R for this. No GPS. I'll make this job a little bit more interesting, won't it? It's opening up pretty nicely. you can see there's actually some areas where it's not been I've not actually grass painted so actually we can just do that and it's gonna expose the area that's already been done
Right, see this edge isn't perfect. So we probably need to do a bit more painting on here. Just take that along a bit more. Uh, plants. Get the grass back. Like I said, I don't mind too much. anyway with the plow. So we just need to see where the field edge is now. So then we can decide how we're going to best paint it back how we're best we're going to plough it back and right up to the road mm. we might possibly just need to even that out a bit Let's have a think. I think we can afford back this up to about here. We're just basically going to be repurposing this field. So we've done our one big super duper harvest on it, which, as I say, nobody predicted how many um, soybeans we would get. You all let me down badly there. And now, we're going to have three fields that we can. Uh, Bomb on. Probably want to get a bigger plow after this.
to speed up this process a bit. This little plough's been nice, don't get me wrong. But I think we could do with a bigger one now. And I've got the funds. I mean, this one's just great, though, for just tipping up these... Um, tipping up these edges. What I'll do is just try and even this out a bit. Now I'm getting my plow on. I think that's a very impressive straight line I managed to drive there. So three fields now, so fields have been split. What I will do is I will carry on now off of camera and get all these fields plowed. Probably have to lime spread. Um, because now we've created new land and then we've plowed land. <laughs> give us a chance technically it's winter we can't really plant anything so we're not at this moment in time missing out on anything so we've got a nice cool million in the bank from finding all the collectibles so I might treat myself to a brand new tractor as well. Get another big machine. Because the 7 rs okay. But it could be a little bit better, I think. We could have something a bit better than the 7R. Which will come in very useful for pulling a bigger plow. see it 
looks as though there is a line here for me to follow. So I'm just going to follow it. Straight edge on the field again. Now, if I turn the um, allow field creation off, look at that! But yeah, I didn't really have too much to do on this field. This field, obviously, just the one edge that we've touched. So yeah, I think what I'll do is I'll go to the store. And uh, we'll buy a brand new uh, tractor. Complement our current lineup of beast mode equipment. Get a new plow as well. And then we'll just absolutely rip up all three of these fields. Perfect. Drop that there. Right, to the store then. To the store. And let's go get a new machine. Hello shop. Right, can I buy a new tractor please? Can I have a large tractor? And uh, let's go and have a look, see what we've got. What have we got to play with? Loads, but I think the next step for us will be perhaps an AR. I would like some decent tyres. I'll have to have Michelin's. We will. That's going to cost me 368,000 for that. I, I'm particularly forced. Bye. Right, let's get ourselves a front weight for that Super Beast tractor. And then we want a bigger plow, don't we? Plows, plows. What have we got in the way of good plows? 
We could have a nice John Deere plow. Have a John Deere Ripper. 2100, that's 6.8 meters, that's nice. But I think we'll go for the 9 meter. Um, black sheet modding jobby. I think that's a good enough plow for us. I probably should have had a look to see what was in the second hand market, really. We don't have a sprayer, do we? We could get a sprayer. Although I'm thinking we've probably got a sprayer. Uh, let's have a look. Sprayers. No custom ones. Interesting. I know there's a whole load of trailers, new trailers. I'll have the nice John Deere PX560. get a nice bigger trailer ready for when we're uh... bad boy That'd be nice to have. Parting around all my crops. Have we got any auger wagons? John Deere augers? No. What about... Uh, we've probably got cultivators in this mod pack that I downloaded. Yeah, the JD Pro Lander 750. Why oh, you've got to always select the colour. Not doesn't come pre-coloured. Pretty cool. Seven and a half meter cultivator. What about cedars? John Deere cedars. Got that one. Odd. Make the uh, Lemkin. Wanted a Lemkin as a John Deere Cedar. Maybe not. That's nice. About planters, maybe. Planter and cedar mod. Except for it doesn't plant and seed, does it? Not the Great Plains, which does do everything.
Sorry, Twackens. AD1. JDZX560. Yeah, that looks all right, doesn't it? That looks pretty decent. 174 grand, though. Yizers. Anyway, let's take what we've purchased. And let's go back to the farm. And like I say, I'm going to carry on ripping up a lot of the map a lot of the fields get them all re-ripped and then we'll sort out what we're going to be seeding in the next episode everybody so be sure to come back and join me in the next episode uh, make sure you've left your like on the video A to prove that you've watched the whole video <laughs> make sure you're subscribed to the channel and you've got your notification bell enabled leave me your comments in the comment section down below and i look forward to seeing you all again very soon from me see take care of yourselves stay safe and goodbye for now